this Wendy Bennett. Um, able to members of the public. Is anyone going to be a objection to be fair on the record? No. Okay. Any members got any interest? Councillor Thompson. Item three. Um, for the awards, I have nominated the person for you.
drivers and their vehicles. Um, as routine on an annual review, um, what we've looked at is the cost of operating the service. And the legislation does allow us to ensure that when we are administering the process, we do recover uh, the costs of the administration process um, and other associated costs with delivering the service. Um, a review this year has identified some gaps whereby we are not currently recovering the full cost of the processes involved in administering those licenses. And you will see from Appendix 1 um, there have been some cost exercises done to bring those fees more in line with the realistic cost of providing that part of the service. In addition, the <coughs> current fees in relation to um, new applications and renewals, um, we do know that there will be, over the next financial year, a 2.2% increase in staffing costs, and we are at asking members to approve um, a 2.2% increase in those fees. Should members agree to um, the proposal <coughs> set out in Appendix 1, then um, they would have to be advertised for a period of 28 days. And if there are any objections, they will be reported back to this committee for consideration. I can advise you that we did consult with the JCC, which members um, will be aware is made up of representations of the trade, and they were they have no objections to the proposed views set out in Appendix One. Okay, any questions? No. Okay, no questions? 